What's up guys, DSR here, just with a quick video. I got a package today, uh, a couple items I ordered off of eBay. Uh, I forget the guy's username, but he was trying to sell off some of his old Gundam model kits that he bought uh, and wanted to paint, never got around to it, so I was just trying to uh, make sure they get to a good home. So, I ordered a few of the kits he had. I wanted to get more, but uh, I don't have the money right now. So, kind of had to miss out on a few things. But I like what I got, and especially for the price. Uh, I picked up these guys for $25 shipped. Each one was about $5, I, I want to say. Five or six dollars each. And I'm missing the tape. There we go. And let's just take a look inside real quick. Down. Okay. That uh, looks like these are all in a lot of parts here. Which is awesome. Wow. Okay. He definitely went all out on making sure nothing got broken in here. Awesome. There we go. Okay. Now, it looks like he has included the instruction manuals for all three of these. The first one being the old, not the newer uh, Hagrid Universal Century, but the original or older uh, Camphor. Um, from Obosu Gundam 00. Uh, I'm not even sure if these are considered high grades. <laughs> That's cute. <laughs> um, I don't know. I wanted to get him mostly because of the weapons that he has. Uh, and see if I can use them in a project or something. I especially liked him for the shotguns. And he is actually painted. I don't know. These look, oh, these look like his, uh, bazookas or rocket launchers or whatever those are. This looks like his torso. I want to say this one was painted black instead of the blue. Yeah, I think this is a part of it. So, uh, I'll have to crack these open. But, um, another one was the, from the same series, I believe. Actually, this one says high grade, so I don't know what the other one is. Uh, okay, the original high grade, uh, GM Sniper. Uh, I got a really old version of the, uh, Ground Gundam. That's a very similar mold with the legs and the arms and everything. But it was totally thrashed when I bought it. Uh, so I just used it for scrap parts. Uh, that one was kind of a bummer. But anyway, so I got, I got a GM Sniper. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with him yet. But, uh... It was like four dollars. I know the kit's like ten, I think. If if you want to buy it plus shipping, so I got it for four. All to ship all of these guys, it was like ten bucks. And then uh, another GNX three. And I originally originally traded the one I had to uh, Josie Barra, and then discovered a really awesome custom I want to do. I want to do like a sort of like the Raphael. Uh, how it's, um, you know, a, a modified version of, like, the Gadessa, or Gadess, or whichever one it was originally, uh, like a Gundam GNX, so we'll see how that plays out, I've got a couple ideas for it, um, so I wanted to pick him up, he was about five bucks, this is the newest kit that I bought, uh, you know, timeline-wise. But uh, I'll have to crack these guys open, and uh, I might do another video showing them all put back together. I don't know. I've been kind of sick lately, like the last week or two, and uh, got a lot of schoolwork and stuff I've been working on. But uh, as always, you can check out my channel at uh, youtube.com slash darkswordragnarok. That's my channel. Uh, it, most of you watching are probably already subscribers, so... <laughs> Uh, you know where to go. See you guys hopefully soon.